हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स आई होप एवरीबॉडी इज वेल नाउ एंड एवरीबॉडी इज प्रिपेयरिंग वेल फॉर द अपकमिंग जेई एग्जाम्स सो दिस क्वेश्चन इज योर जेई मेंस 2021 24th फेब फर्स्ट शिफ्ट प्रॉब्लम इट इज एंड दिस इज अ सिंगल ऑप्शन करेक्ट क्वेश्चन इन दिस क्वेश्चन इट इज सेड दैट लेट पी एंड क्यू बी टू पॉजिटिव इंटीजर्स सच दैट पी प्लस क्यू इज टू पी रेज पा फोर प्लस क्यू रेज पा फोर इज टू सेवेंटी टू then p and q are the roots of the equation that means we need to tell the equation whose roots are p and q so as we already know the equation with roots p and q can be written as equations with roots p and q can be given as x square minus p plus q into x plus p q is equal to zero, and in this question p plus q is already given. So basically, we need to find p into q only. So if p plus q is two, and if I square both side, I would be getting p square plus q square plus two p q is equal to four. From here, we would be getting p square plus q square is equal to four minus two p q. If I square once again, I would be getting p square plus q square whole square will be equal to four minus two p q whole square. Now, squaring both sides, you would be getting p raised power four plus q raised power four plus two p square q square is equal to Sixteen plus four p square q square. Because here a minus b whole square identity we can use four square is sixteen. Two p q square is four p square q square minus four to the eight to the sixteen p q. In place of p q raised to power four plus q raised to power four we can put two seventy two. And two uh, p square q square is equal to sixteen plus Four p square q square minus sixteen p q. Now let us rearrange the terms. This will be giving you two p square q square. This is four p square square q square and two p square square square. This will give you two p square q square. If I take this term towards right hand side, and minus sixteen p q, and sixteen minus two seventy two. Will be giving you, I guess, two fifty six is equal to zero. Correct. So this will give you p square q square minus eight p q minus one twenty eight is equal to zero. That's a quadratic in p q. Yes. So we can simplify this quadratic, factorize this quadratic. So We'll have to split this middle term. This is one twenty-eight. So one twenty-eight is sixteen eighths. So this can be written as P Q minus sixteen into P Q plus eight is equal to zero. That means this will give you P Q is equal to sixteen or minus eight. But in the question, it is said that. P and Q are two positive numbers. That means this is not possible. So this will be taken. Now, if P Q is sixteen, so the required equation will be x square minus P plus Q is two. So the required equation will become x square minus P plus Q is two. So two x. P Q is sixteen plus sixteen is equal to zero. This will be the required equation. So our answer for the question will be x square minus two x plus sixteen is equal to zero. Option B is the right answer. Fine. Thank you, all of you guys.